we all get a little more self-conscious when we're around our crush. We might put on extra deodorant, make sure there's nothing stuck in between our teeth, and wear our best clothes. But what happens when your crush is an introvert? They might not even notice you when they've got their head buried in their book. Your paths rarely cross when it seems like the two of you have different interests. And yet, it only took one time for you to notice how special they are. Here are five helpful tips when your crush is an introvert. 1. Just because they're still reserved around you doesn't mean they always will be. Patience is the way to an introvert's heart. It takes time for introverts to open up. It might seem like they're not into you if they're emotionally reserved, but this doesn't mean they don't want to get any closer to you. I thought my boyfriend wasn't into me on our first date when he was closed off, but boy was I wrong. Give them time and don't be discouraged or intimidated. Instead, see it as an opportunity to work up your charm. 2. When making plans, choose less crowded places that are comfy and casual. Introverts prefer comfy, low-key settings over loud, hectic areas. This doesn't mean they never go to big events or parties, but they prefer to do it in small doses. When choosing activities to do together, be considerate and pick fun things the both of you can enjoy without stressing your crush out. Going to the beach when it's not so busy, watching a movie on rainy days, and visiting the art museum are all some options to keep in mind. My boyfriend's personal favorite is going to quiet places with me where he can get great shots on his camera. 3. Don't take it personally if your crush needs some alone time. You probably want to spend as much time with them as possible. That's understandable. Who doesn't enjoy hanging out with their crush? But introverts can get overwhelmed after a long day. Even extroverts need to recharge. Be supportive and allow them time to unwind. It just means they're preparing for the next time you guys hang out. Bonus points if you leave them a cute note or encouraging text. 4. Speaking of texts, find out the best way they prefer to communicate. Some introverts, especially shy ones, feel more comfortable texting instead of talking in person when you first meet them, whereas others hate texting all the time and prefer to make plans to hang out in person. Find out what their communication patterns are and contact them accordingly. My boyfriend hates talking on the phone unless it's an emergency, so we stick to face-to-face -face conversations and text messages. It might be hard to get the ball rolling initially, but introverts like to feel connected to the people they talk to, so skip the small talk and dive deep. 5. You don't have to be introverted to make a good impression. Yes, birds of a feather flock together, but opposites also attract. Just because your crush is an introvert doesn't mean they're expecting their ideal lover to be one too. If you're an extrovert, be mindful of their space and always ask before assuming they like going to the same exciting places as you. Introverts know how to have fun too, but some activities, events, and settings can be too much for them. It's not about changing who you are, but meeting somewhere in the middle. Introverts can be hard to read, so we hope these tips can come in handy. What are some challenges you face with your introverted crush? Please share your thoughts with us below. Also, don't forget to subscribe for more content from Psych2Go and check out our Patreon. Thanks for watching!